And on the eighth day, Garth looked down on his donated paradise and said, I need someone to exploit this. So Garth made a GSBR. Garth said, I need pro athletes, doctors, NASA scientists, Navy SEALs, professional actors, princesses, race car drivers, and a whole lot of consultants and bankers. So Garth made a GSBR. Garth said, I need somebody willing to attend summer camp for late adolescence. Party all night, wake up hungover. Ace an interview, go to class in plastic wayfarers, fall asleep, wake up, get cold called, pass, and then leave to get coffee. I need somebody who will skip class to play a round of golf in the afternoon, take it out debt to buy dinner, pregame in Schwab, and then go out and party all night in downtown Palo Alto while wearing a Halloween costume made for a ten-year-old. So Garth made a GS beer. Garth said, I need somebody crazy enough to spend a hundred dollars on a costume so they can dress like their parents, get on a plane, fly to Vegas, party all night on a Tuesday, get drunk, get lost, get married, and somehow make it home in time for class. It had to be somebody who'd come from an unfulfilling job, but sell other people on it. Somebody to booze, schmooze, flues, and carouse, and network and interview, and throw the white parties, and rent the party buses, and then end it all by lounging in the California sunshine, complaining about how busy they are. Somebody who would bail a network of friends together with the soft, strong bonds of lifetime affiliation, who would laugh and then sigh, and then reply with teary eyes when his fellow students say that all they want is to spend two more years doing nothing, just like he does. So Garth, made a GS beer.